Uh, Jonathan, can you please send in the next applicant, please? Ah, hello. Welcome, Mr. Huh? Mr. Oh. Bit of a, bit of a giveaway, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry? I'm... Well, it's the very same. I beg your pardon? That's Harry. <coughs> Harry Potter? Yeah, should be down there. Yes, yes. <laughs> um, welcome. Uh, we here at Aldi are looking for the best and brightest recent high school graduates. And of course, you graduated from... Um, oh, it doesn't quite say here. Um, wh where did you graduate from? Do you know King's Cross Station? Of course. Platform 9? Uh, the South and Line? And 3 quarters. And... Platform 9 and 3 quarters. Well on your way, so... Pop that in. Um, and the name of the school quite simply was... Hogwarts. Sorry? Hogwarts. Is what it was? Hogwarts? Yeah. Oh, I, hmm, I don't think I've heard of um, Hogwarts near the King's Cross station. Yeah, well, you know, it's a bit of an it crowd thing. And how did you place? Well, I was sort of running that shit, to be honest. Oh, pardon my parcel tongue. Um, yeah, yeah, one of the big dogs. One of the main characters. Well, um, communication is very important as a stock attendant here at Aldi, so how did you do in English? Uh, yeah, fluent. Oh, not my best subject, though. No. Uh, no, a bit more of a maths man, me. Oh, maths. Well, how did you place? Uh, poof, God, where to begin? Uh, addition, adding up. Uh, got all the way up there. One, two, three, you know, I mean, it doesn't bloody matter if you catch the snitch. So. Hmm. Um, uh, what about um, leadership positions? No. Oh. What? This bloke. Uh, oh. <laughs> yeah, 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 fair few. Fair few. Uh, Great. Uh, led a certain Dumbledore's army against a little known Lord Voldemort. Is that a, is that a football team? Is that a football? <sighs> Look, man. I think I better be up front with you. Oh. Um, in certain circle, Harry Potter's on a geezer needs to hear to sort us out with a frothy fucking butter beer on the house. Picking up what I'm putting down, you know? Like, uh, I don't wear it lightly. You know, I don't like to be fussed over. But at the end of the day, I am the boy who lived, you know? And sure, I could get a job at the ministry like any other hippogriff and their mums, but where's the grit in that? You know, that's not real after what I've been through. We wumping under the same willow? Um, uh, uh, Mr. Potter, are you um, uh, currently on drugs? No, no, I don't believe what they're saying down at Diagon Alley either, all right? Potter's off the fucking potions, man. Yeah, but I'm not living under the stairs anymore. <laughs> well, I mean, I am, but it's temporary. Um, well, we here at Aldi have a zero tolerance policy towards the use of any illicit substances. Look, man, look, I just, I just need the job. Yeah, yeah well, I just really need the job. So, yeah. well, I can forward you on to the rehabilitation centres that we are in connection with. And... Oh, I just need money. I need money for crack. They're not fucking wizard crack or nothing. Just proper fucking crack. Okay, Mr. Potter, pull yourself together. Oh. Ginny left me. Don't. Mr. Potter, <laughs> there is a stack of canned goods at the front of our store that you are free to take from with a no questions asked policy. I'll suck your dick, Gov. I'll suck it so fucking good, man. There's 20 quid, yeah? I can get back on track with just 20 quid. Good day, Mr. Potter. Yeah. But back at high school, I was the fucking king, man. And now, Draco Malfoy is associate director of Gringotts, and I'm schlepping like a house elf for a job at some shithole supermarket. It's not a shithole. But it does not do well to dwell on dreams and forget to live. A friend of mine told me that. Cut's fucking dead. Uh, Jonathan, can you please send in the next applicant? Uh, Percy Jackson and the Sea of Monsters. Thank you.